you know, arguably a puff Samus dual main, but really, especially recently, he's just been a Samus yeah, main. Yeah, I've been and seeing a lot of It's Samus. really refre refreshing. He even, like, this is Falcon we're talking about, and he's not switching to Puff, who arguably has a decent Falcon matchup. Yeah. And, and Samus, I think even dedicated Samus mains talk about how this matchup sucks. I, uh... I, we have we have a lot of we have a lot of jokes about in the community about matchup uh, like you know Kirby Falcons 50 50 right 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 Falcon Thomas I don't think we, anyone, talk, uh, we talk about it being like a hundred zero it's, it's not a joke it's yeah. not a joke yeah, it's actually, pretty yeah, freaking bad you're right the joke is that it's unwinnable uh, <laughs> and it, it's commonly like thought to be like one of those really near unwinnable matchups Hammerheart has shown that he really likes the matchup and he's pretty good at it. Oh, no down air? But uh, we'll see. Lodo is a very strong player. Hammerheart's got to be careful here. Yeah. Oh, great DI for great Hammerheart DI. to stay on stage. Oh, great fair recovery. Uh, Just walks up slowly. Tries to so, smash. And we'll see a lot of that from Samus. Samus, ha oh, wow. Samus has got to do a lot of interesting movement things. Yeah. Wow, Lodo not messing around. Hammerheart down early. And you'll notice, like, even off of, uh, even off of his invincibility, Hammerheart had to retreat. He's got to play the retreating game. Reverse uh, back air, not what he wanted Good there. opportunity, yeah, But okay. he'll get the dare. Great, yeah, so he's got, he's got a one-stock deficit here. Definitely still doable for Hammerheart, but he's got to play real patient in this game one if he's... Not yeah. trying to go down a game quick to load. He's got to be extremely careful in this matchup. Right, and and Falcon's so fast. Nice grab. Yeah, that was a beautiful grab. Oh my goodness! And Hammerheart with a very quick stock on Lodo well, in a very up. and and uh, never mind. What I was just gonna mention. Oh, is oh wow, great from Lodo, Lodo to take that stock right back. back. And this is a matchup up air is always good for Falcon. But in this matchup, it really sucks. Samus just kind of gets brutalized by up air. Really good DI might help you, but it's really hard for Hammerheart's got to play extremely careful to avoid getting hit by those types of aerials. Oh, that was not a good roll. Not that no. there are many rolls by Samus that are good rolls. So yeah, wow. <laughs> That'll do Lodo, it. Lodo not messing around with those low recoveries. That's twice that he dropped immediately off ledge and back air, just trying to get Hammerheart away. There's, he knows he'll trade at minimum. Right. There's not over. much that Samus can do in that position without putting uh, without putting herself in a uh, in a position where she can't recover. You can. Down air trade, maybe, but you still lose your sock. Right, so. exactly. And yeah, he, here's at, his, on his last. Stop. And I, I, I mentioned at the start of the match that I love that he sticks Samus, but I think I, Lodo just looked like he had a handle on that matchup, and it's really tough. Definitely. So we'll see his puff. Oh wow, he likes Hammerheart. Really likes his puff. He plays different than a lot of puffs. He isn't super standard for one. For two, he just plays the control a bit weird. Although he's playing it pretty standard now. So one thing you'll see from a lot of safe puffs, and really puffs who have gone on to challenge top falcons around the world like Wangara, the puffs are challenging falcons like Wangara. Right. Again. Sorry, not that Wangara's a falcon. Right. Uh, right. Uh, is staying under side plat and playing a very campy, patient game. It's really difficult for Falcon to approach there, and and you just sort of read a movement and try and get a grab and convert that into a kill. So we're, we are seeing a bit of that from Hammerheart, sticking under stage like that. Yeah, he's but having a Lodo, lot of trouble getting, uh, getting into Lodo. Lodo's just all over the place right now. Yeah, and, and Lodo Lodo's putting out a lot of hitboxes, putting a lot of pressure on Hammerheart to play extremely well. Yeah. Finds the grab, and that's a that's good, gonna do it. That's Just a good like back that. throw from Hammerheart. He could have forward thrown to to up air to back air or something. But wow, good. good DI, but not enough. Yeah, that was fast. He really had strong DI in that. Interesting option with the nair. Um, oh, oh, yeah, that's a he didn't late. he didn't want that. Yeah, he, Hammerheart looked upset about doing that. It's a really good chase, but oh wow! Somehow gets, and that's that's this should be a stock. Yeah, that's yeah. it. Wow, 
Hammerheart able to clean that stock out, brings it back to even. He's at a really dangerous percent here, but he survives the invincibility, so we'll see if he can get an opening before Lodo does. Try and take a little bit of command of this game and the set. Yeah, I don't. I think that at this percent uh, um, from by oh. the ledge. Yeah. Oh, nice. That's a beautiful double up air conversion into a rest. It yeah. can be hard to get that second up air falling up air, but opts to go for that instead of... Uh, That'll do it. I was going to say that most of uh, most of Falcon's uh, aerials at that percent we're going to do, uh, we're, we're pretty much going to put Jigglypuff in uh, a very, very, very bad position, if not dead. Right. And, and, and that's the, the... When you get a free hit like through invincibility on Puff in this matchup, usually it's down air. Oh, this is oh. going to be tough. For Hammerheart, yeah, he's it. running out of jumps. Yeah, he's out of jumps, in fact. Lodo takes game two. This is someone touching his controller. Oh, CPO. The switch back to Samus. Interesting. I mean, so we saw a moment of brilliance from Hammerheart Samus with that one stock he took to bring it to even when it was 3-2. And that, if he can do that consistently, this will go well for him. But the rest of the match, I mean, when he was doing well in the matchup, it, he just avoided getting hit by all aerials, which is a tall order. Oh, down air? Yes, beautiful, beautiful. conversion. Yeah, he uh, turned good. that situation around. He was in a really bad spot. Oh, great. Uh, that that defensive bomb it has been really popular amongst the Samai. Oh, oh, not able to get the the DI but not enough damage he stays on stage Lodo oh almost too far out stage but makes it back scary situation for Lodo that's gonna do it yeah there's no jump there oh Lodo. he did have a jump oh, oh Lodo, Lodo again Hammerheart did have a jump Lodo I gets that falling back air I don't know when he landed I don't know he, he messed up I don't think he used it in the first place it was actually what happened. but Lodo Finally messes up that falling back air. See, again, these up airs. With the eye from Hammerheart, he mixed it up. He went in to out. Up, up he oh, just, my goodness. Up he just clanked with back air. I've never seen that. Well, it was really parried by the invincibility. Yeah, then no jump there from Hammerheart. And we're even? Even stocks. Not even in games. Hammerheart's got a lot of work to do if he's going to bring this back in a best of five. Especially in this matchup. Also worth noting that Lodo plays Samus. Not, I, I don't know how frequently in big tournaments, but like he has a up Samus. Up smash. Oh my goodness. Rare you see a Samus up smash in and, top and 16 have it, like, or whatever. And slightly work. Uh, That's going to do it. This is going to be tough for Hammerheart. He's got to get a quick kill here and then a full stock. Looks like Tech he chase opportunity. It. Ooh, good recovery there from Lodo. Off stage. Oh, Goes for the high nair, but good up B from Lodo. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Lodo with just, just throwing out his entire bag yeah, of tricks. Oh, oh, went for it. Misses the double dunk. Hammerheart staying alive. Gets a second lease at this. At this his is Hammerheart's tournament, tournament stock. Yeah. Oh. They get the invincibility parry on the up B. Lodo playing really patient here. We got uh, some calls for timeouts in the crowd. <laughs> it's five, there's five, five and a half, five minutes, and a half left. minutes on the clock as Samus timeout. I, I mean, really, Falcon could time Samus out. I mean, oh, wow. Beautiful. He switches to the, the backwards facing charge shot just to reverse and get that back air. Bringing it back inch by inch. Playing super careful. Oh, oh he overextended. The oh, so did Lodo, <laughs> but. He was in a much safer ah! position. Samus is way too slow to get down there in time. Oh, this misses is that charge shot. This is really bad. Really bad for Hammerheart, and it's oh, over. Oh, that's it. Lodo 3-0's Hammerheart feeling himself. Mm -hmm.